Hey, uh, real quick, before we do anything, I got two things we gotta do. I do a really bad podcast called Cut the Tape, and for like the last six years, there's been no intro to it. So Lucas is gonna record everyone, and on the count of three, I need everyone to say, Cut the Tape, and that's gonna be the intro to the show. Okay, so one, two, three. Cut the tape! Lucas, did you get that? Yeah, I think so. Okay, cool. Okay, welcome to Cut the Tape. It's uh, an episode I've been putting off for a while, but you know what? It's just time to do it. It's like a Band-Aid, need to rip it off. I'm Rick Alvarez, uh, welcome. It's been a while since we've seen each other. I am still clean shaven, doing the whole year, no shave. Or doing the whole year, no beard. I'm shaving, which is weird, because usually I have a beard. But, brings me to this. Uh, today we're talking about jets. I got Starscream. This is the movie edition Starscream jet. And we'll get to that, uh, if there's time. Uh, this is the HasLab Sky Striker. I thought we'd get to this first. So, gonna reposition this a little bit. There we go. Coming at you from the world famous frame and picture shop. So, the Sky Striker that got released during my tenure at Hasbro was made from an existing Sky Striker toy. We purchased two of them. And I purchased two discreetly. And then uh, we retro molded it from the original Sky Striker. We redid the inside, so it sat one person. And unfortunately, the missiles never quite fit on that thing. Man, that was a bummer. Uh, I remember in the employee store, I think Sky Striker was for like six or seven bucks a pop. I have like 26, 27 of them. I have like a stack of them. And since I have my own aircraft carrier at home, I built a custom USS flag. That's 16 and a half feet long by six and a half feet wide. It fits like 26 Sky Strikers on it. All right, this will be a nice piece to add to it. Let's see, okay. So this is like a little landing strip here. I'm gonna open this. And inside we have, that is the base that you can position your Sky Striker on. But then we have these pieces, which come to us from the USS Flag, which are repurposed. I, I think these are, yeah, these are remakes of the, uh, of the ones that came with the USS Flag, right? Let's see, we have, These are always weird, like these little bags. Tail fins, chairs, I really don't want to take the parachute out. I really don't. What else is in here? Ah, cockpit glass. We have a pair of wings, some more tail feathers. What do we got here? Oh, we got blast effects. Yep. For the, so we got blast effects for the chairs. <sighs> and then these go on the back of the jet. I think those are a great touch.
Oh, this is cool. This is a uh, missile blast effects. I wasn't really paying attention to what all the add-ons were. But I know they all made it out. They got all the add-ons. I have no idea what those pieces are. Let's see. Oh, more blast effects. Very cool. Very cool. So we have missile blast effects, long range, short range, and then um, weapon, you know, like the guns. The, the guns on the jet. All right. We got some awesome missiles. Belly Buster. Oh, man. I, you know what? I, I'm kind of not annoyed by the, uh, the paper. It's just, it's easy. It works. All right. We have... Very nice. These are carded in the way, these are O-ring figures, brand new O-ring figures, carded the same way. Original O-ring figures would have been, so you have to rip these open to play with them. I ain't doing that. All right, so this is fail safe. Oh, look, it's not carded all the way. Uh, I hope the glue doesn't come off on these. I, re I really hope the glue doesn't come off on these. All right, Cobra Commander, check out the logo. That is, known in the fandom as the Mickey Mouse logo because it's not meant to be Mickey Mouse. It's just a nickname that people have given it. That's all because of the way the logo looks. All right, we have, very nice, Cobra Trooper. Who would have thought after all G.I. Joe has been through, Sigma-6, the films, the new modern body that we'd be back to O-rings. Not I, this is a pilot Scarlet. And here is uh, Ace. These, these would look great next to your vintage G.I. Joe figures. This is Night Force Ripcord. You know, I don't know if Ripcord was ever in Night Force originally. I think that's a new Night Force figure. Cobra Ground Crew. You know, to direct your Rattlers. You don't have a Joe Ground Crew, you got a Cobra one. But you know, yeah, you take what you can get. All right. I really don't mind the paper. It's it's easy to open. I really don't mind the paper. All right. So now this comes off. And inside we have various assortment of stickers. We have Cobra stickers. You want to make it a Cobra Sky Striker. Regular stickers. We have instruction sheets. We have sticker instruction sheets. We have various different. You know what's great about these is that I have all those other Sky Strikers, and I absolutely am going to use all these stickers to customize all those Sky Strikers. Oh, that's going to be awesome. That's that's a win. I that those sticker sheets. They might be the best part for me. Oh. Woo! There it is. Oh. Something about getting a box that's not a window box that's just so, so 
nice. It feels good. Like I'm getting a toy. I'm getting a real toy because it's. I can't see the toy. It's not a. It's not a window box. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. How 80s not to have. Oh, and here we are again. Go into, you know, carded figures don't come carded anymore. They come in windowless boxes. Amazing. Amazing how we've gone full circle. All right, here we go. Huh. Very interesting that we have that canopy. And then we have this canopy as well. Oh, I see. So that's a classic canopy versus a new style of canopy. You get your choice. All right. I see now. I understand what's happening. engines you know what we're just cutting these hey there it is easy peasy Whew. huh kind of a um doesn't have much of a scent to it very neutral, very, very neutral scent. Hmm. Doesn't smell like plastic. So here's the underbelly, right? I mean, it's a whole new Sky Striker, but what do we got? Now we got the cable, right? We got the cable hook. Oh! <laughs> oh, that's cool. So the cable hook is what you use to lower the... <sighs> this was well thought out. This was very well thought out. All right. All right. Let's put this thing together. Snap together very well. All right. Let's put those tail feathers on. Very nice. And now you have your choice. Nice. You can do black tail feathers, or you can do, ooh. What, what color do I, do I go with the classic black or do I? Do I go with the classic black? Do I do a solid more real world? I'm gonna do the I'm gonna do the solid more real world color. Maybe these go. Yeah, I'm gonna go the more, you know, Maverick type colors. Nice, 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 nice. All right, let's see. So we have our canopy that opens and we can switch it out to a different canopy if we want. We have our chairs. And 
then what's cool is this will even fit inside of here so we can have the chairs blasting off. Very nice. Very, very nice. Nice, nice, nice. Nice. if I remember from my childhood what missiles go where all right well you know what's great is that these missiles actually fit on here without any problem They stay on there, which is great. I'm gonna put these up here, you know, classic style. And then, what we can do is we can take these parts and then we could put these parts in here and add extra missiles that you couldn't add to your original Sky Striker. Ooh. Beautiful. Oh, I love it. Absolutely love it. Love it. Absolutely love it. Fantastic. Well done. Very happy with this. Oh, I mean, come on. This is great. This is great. Of course, we can't forget. This, the engines. It's a bit of a tight fit. Really tight fit. They're supposed to slide in a certain way. You know what? I'd rather have it fit tight than it be all loosey goosey. Boy, you know what? Some love was definitely put into this. Love was definitely put into this. Whew. Now, you know, we could we could add stuff like this to it, right? We can add this is great. I love this. Absolutely love this. Wow, man, those fit in there too. We can add. Well, this is really meant for. How do these connect? Interesting, they don't show you how these ones connect, even though these are four. Hmm, that's interesting. They don't show, I mean, these all can't be for here, right? I mean, they all fit in there, but that can't be right. When in doubt, look on the box. That's what we did as kids. Oh, I see. Stupid me. That's what it is. You hook them to the back of the missile. That's what it is. Oh my God, I am gonna have fun stickering this. This is great. This is a pure, pure joygasm. <sighs> Let's put this on here. Oh. Beautiful. 
beautiful. I love it. Oh, my goodness. Oh, well done. Well done. Bravo. God. That, that is gorgeous. And that really stays on there, too. Oh, and you can tighten this, too. You can make it looser. You can make it tighter. Oh, well done. Absolutely phenomenal performance. And what's great is, unlike the original Sky Striker, you can have the wings out without having the landing gear down. It's a little, it's, it's actually a little weird for me to see a Sky Striker with the wings out and not, <laughs> not have the landing gear deployed. That's, <laughs> it's not off-putting. It's, it's, it's weird though. It's, it's a little bizarre. It's a little, it's a little bizarre. <laughs> I love it. I absolutely, I, you know what? I'm a huge Transformers fan. And I got just about every single has lap thing there is. Uh, I think even, you know, more than the Ghostbusters thing or the, the Transformers thing. I think this might be my favorite one. I, I think it might be my favorite one because honestly, Sky Striker ain't coming out at retail again. It ain't. I wish it were, but it ain't. That, I love this. It makes me want to go open all my other Sky Strikers. And I may have to now. I may have to now. All right. I don't even want to open the Starscream. That's going to ruin the experience. I, I've played with that a million times. I don't need to open another Starscream. This. Oh, this is what I need in my life. I should have bought a dozen of these. God damn it. That is beautiful. All right. Well, you know what? Cut the tape is over. I'm going to go play with myself. <laughs> I'm going to go play with this by myself. All right. Wash your hands. Register to vote. Uh, be kind to others. Adopt animals and spade or neuter your pets. Uh, thank you very much. We'll see you next time on Cut the Tape. Let's just, let's just turn off. Turn this off.